Roku slowing down? Acting glitchy? A factory reset can get it working like new. Just keep in mind, resetting Roku will erase all your apps, passwords, and data, so you should only do this as a last resort. The easiest way to factory reset a Roku is by using the reset button, which is usually on the back or bottom of the device, but not every Roku has one. While your Roku is plugged in, simply press and hold the reset button for about 10 seconds until you see the light start flashing. If you don't see a reset button on your Roku, you can also reset it using the remote instead. To factory reset a Roku device, press the home button on your remote and go to settings. Then select system and go to advanced system settings. Next, go to factory reset and enter the code in the bottom right corner of your screen. Finally, select OK and choose Start Factory Reset. Your TV will turn off and you will need to set it up from scratch. If you're planning to sell or give away your Roku, you can unplug it once it restarts. If you're not near your Roku, you can still sign out remotely. To do this, Go to my.roku.com and sign in to your Roku account. Then choose the Roku you want to remove and select Remove Device from Account. Finally, select Yes, Remove Device to confirm. Then you will be signed out of that Roku device so no one can access your apps or make purchases on your account. If these steps helped, please leave a like and subscribe for more easy how-to videos.